Alagay, firstly, a happy new year and a happy start to the new year. Good win. Yeah, it was a good win. You know, it, it, it was tight game in us. It, it, we knew it was going to be like that and we were hoping it would be like that as well because uh, it's hard to beat competitive games at this time of year and, and uh, Fermanagh kept it going rightly and I thought we got four points ahead at one stage and I thought that, that, that we'd maybe push on and win the game but Fermanagh and Fairnstown came right back at us but I thought the boys showed, you know, we showed good composure both sides of the field. We, we didn't give away any silly freeze up at, the, at, at one end and then we were able to nick a score down at the other end and kept ahead. So, no, pleased with that point of view but at the same time it's it, it, it's, it's great for us as well because we know we have a lot of things to improve on and we know as well that Fermanagh come here in the 20th of May and we know exactly what they're going to bring. They're, you know, It's going to be a really, really tight game. So it's, it's, from all those points of view, it's, it's good and then we're just glad to get through it today. You touched on a word there, competitive, and it was from start to finish because it was the goal, I suppose, give you a little cushion throughout that game was David McAllister's goal, uh, one of the three players that you handed a senior debut to. So it was a perfect start for David. That's right, yeah. And I thought that we worked the goal very well and David finished it very well. And it, I suppose it gave us that wee cushion that we kept right throughout the game. Um, so that, no, that, that was very pleasing. And there was, there was a number of lads who came in and, and, and they fitted into the, in, into the team very well. So that, that was good. Uh, there was a number of fellas who, who, have, who haven't done you know, that much training and so it's just it's just very much a, a, a balancing act but at the same time good good to get a, a good competitive game good to get the the run into the boys legs and it'll it'll you know it'll bring us forward into the next couple of games the kind of cup it's all about preparation for the league of course and trying out new players and you did as i said hand out three debuts there it's all about game time i suppose next week against antrim it'll be a different players coming in and it's all about giving them game time and getting to look at them and games like that there it's a perfect way to look at players that's right yeah because when, it, when it's competitive like that you, you know what, what what boys are capable of you know if, if you're if you're winning easily or you're being beat well neither way it does you much good so it's, it's great having a competitive game like that it tells you a lot about players and you know, a lot of the boys stood up well today and, and, and did very well and again you know we're not expecting miracles overnight there's a number of them, them younger lads and, and fellas who haven't been exposed at this level before who you know if they make a few mistakes if, if they don't play well you can't just just, you know, uh, forget about them. You have to nurse them along and, 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 and help them to learn from all the experiences they have. And they've all got a great attitude and they're, they're very committed to it. And that's, that's the most important thing. So, no, hopefully they'll go from strength to strength. And it's, it, it's a good start for us. And now it's, it's about just it's about looking at it during the week to see what, what areas we need to improve and, and uh, trying to push on again next next weekend, get, getting a, a good result next Sunday and, and trying to qualify for the, for the semi-final stages. Antrim lost this afternoon, so I suppose they'll be out to prove a point next week. But that's what you do want. It's teams giving it their all. And as you said, you're going to be playing for Mana in May, so that'll be a different cattle and fish to this afternoon, of course. Yeah, there's, there's no doubt it, it will. Both, both lineups will be changed a lot. The players will be at a different level of fitness. Um, and I suppose it depends a lot. There'll be a lot of things have changed in, in the meantime with, with, with having a, a National League campaign, a Dr. McKenna Cup campaign, then a National League campaign. So different players can come in and out of form, and, and different teams are in. I you know at a different level and, and has both different mindsets at that time of year. So, uh, so no, look, there's, there's a lot of work to be done before that. But no, it, 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 listen, as I said before, we know exactly what what it's going to be like here on May the twentieth, and and all all the games before we play before that will hopefully prepare us well for it. Finally, Malachy, just before I let you go, the introduction of the mark again back into Gaelic games. I suppose is it something the manager and players work on at training, or is it just a bonus if you catch the ball between the two forty five and the kick out? Yeah, well, look at you know I think the way the game has gone, you know, there's 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 not too many teams putting a real emphasis on on trying to catch the ball in there, as well as that the game has become so I suppose fluid and, and fast moving that it, it's not necessarily in your best interest to catch it and hold it up and take a free. So most of the times, even when it was caught today. Most people just played the, uh, the ball has moved on, and uh, uh, so it'll it'll be interesting to see. I don't, I don't think it'll make a massive difference. Maybe it will if you if you'd uh, three or four you know massive men out in the middle that you could be sure of winning primary possession. Maybe you'd use it more. But I suppose with us a lot of the time it's 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 just playing to our advantages, and, and a lot of the time the quick kick out works, and it's, it's looking for players running into space and things like that. So it'll I suppose it'll be interesting to see how, how it goes as, as as time goes on. But uh, I don't think it'll make a massive impact. <laughs>